Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 2 video review reveals everything you have been dying to know. Samsung kept its card pretty close to the chest when it unveiled Galaxy Z Fold 2 during its August 5th virtual unpacked event. The company said that it will have more to share on September the 1 and that also when it start taking pre-orders for its new foldable smartphone. But however, it appears that some units have found their way into the wild already and we have been seeing leaks comes up over the past few weeks and no full-blown Galaxy Z Fold 2 video review has been published online. The reviewer give us some nice clear shot of the device including its new functionality. You can see just how flex mode works on the device and the angles at which the display can freely stand upright. This allows you for a number of interesting use cases, particularly when watching multimedia content. The video review also confirmed that it's now possible to take a selfie with the rear camera by using the cover display as a viewfinder, a feature that we have long waited for. We also get to see how the software has been improved. Multiple active windows looks much better and so does the UI response when the handset is being used in flex mode. What is more interesting is its side-by-side -side shot with the Galaxy Fold that are really interesting. You get a sense of just how mature the Galaxy Z Fold 2 feels compared to its predecessor. The design itself looks great, the finish is immaculate and the large cover and internal display are in a league of their own. The tall 60Hz 6.23 inch of cover display with the 25 by 9 aspect ratio is a major upgrade over the first generation fold which has a 4.6 inch of external display it offers all the functionality of a regular non-folding phone so you don't have to constantly resort to the main 7.6 inch panel we can also see that samsung logo on the hinge is centered this time whereas the original fold had it on the top corner also the reviewer has shared the anti-2 benchmark score for the galaxy z fold 2 and it's coming with a 5 lakh and 89,000 of anti-2 benchmark score we are also getting more details on the three 12 megapixel Pixel rear cameras including a breakdown of their exact sensor. The main shooter is Sony IMX555 with optical image stabilization while the other two sensors are ultra wide and telephoto modules are coming from Samsung. Flex mode UI adds plenty of versatility for the camera app and we can also see controls on the right one side and a viewfinder on the left and the live preview on the top. There's also a neat tent mode which is used for pulling a navigation in a car and keeps the main inside display turned off to preserve the battery life. There's also no way to hold the Galaxy Z Fold 2 wrong as the UI works in all four directions and even upside down. The reviewer mentioned the 4500mAh of a battery performed advocately through his testing period was not long enough for detailed observation. So I personally believe that Galaxy Z Fold 2 is going to be one of the best innovation which has been coming from Samsung this year in terms of foldable devices. So guys what do you think about the upcoming Galaxy Z Fold 2? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and also please do consider subscribing my channel for more updates. Thanks for watching this video. Peace out.